Hey guys, I'm here with our friend Kelly Cody and we've got a lovely remodel on our hands today in the city of Ojai. It's a crisp winter's afternoon. Let's go check it out. So Kelly is the interior designer on this project and uh, one of the things that she's incorporated is the full height detail of these ceiling recessed cavity sliders down the hallway. Truly, it's my favorite and I think the most important element to this remodel was not limiting the height of the ceilings by doing door frames at six feet tall. Here we've shown the full height of the walls and the doors and created something very special. We couldn't have done it without cavity sliders because we were able to carve out this vestibule space and make the hallway actually twice its size, which is quite unique and feels terrific when guests are around. Or there's three of us standing in this area now and neither one of us, we're all socially distanced. Uh, <laughs> but really pleased with the way it turned out. Again, the height made all the difference in the world, carving out the space, creating this vestibule to service a bedroom and an office and a bathroom. And then at any time, the double bypass doors here were just a hit. One of the areas that we've seen pocket doors become a lot more popular over time is in these contemporary modern settings. So you've got these full height openings matched with these range of colors. Can you tell us the backstory on those? Man, I am just pro color. Everybody use color, 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 color. One of our homeowners is an artist, Joanne Block, and this came off of one of her pieces of artwork. I was greatly inspired by these colors and then in combination with a piece of artwork that she had done years ago for her wife. So I really wanted this design in this bathroom just to feel desert, simple, not a lot of uh, too much interest. I wanted everything to feel calm like the desert that we're living in here. So the pocket doors again add that calm and a little bit of color on this one along with the white walls just did the trick. The blue represents the sky and the water and the sand colored tile of course the desert. Earth. 